Why is your hair out of place? <gasps> you slut. Did a big old barge finally come through your Panama Canal? No, as I'm being reminded for the 13th time today, I have not had sex in a really long time. You and me both, sister. <laughs> I was at the gynecologist. When he found out I was turning 30, he went on about how time was running out for me if I wanted to have a child. He actually said tick-tock as he swiped my cervix. A male gynecologist? Ooh, I don't trust a man who looks at my vagina and doesn't get turned on. Don't worry, Caroline. You're still young. You have plenty of time to have kids. No, I don't. According to my life plan, I was supposed to be married last year, have conceived nine months ago, and be giving birth this month. I'm not even dating anyone. Your plan is that specific? Yeah. Not all of us are going to get pregnant from sitting in a hot tub. Okay, first of all, it was a jacuzzi. And second of all, the doctor said it was just gas from all of the champagne. I just should have frozen some of my eggs when I donated back in college. Wait, you donated your eggs? I thought that was just for unattractive people who couldn't strip their way through law school. I had to. My father cut me off from my trust fund for a semester when I dated a Democrat. Well, ladies, as much as this conversation has reaffirmed my belief in assisted suicide, we have to go turn children into mindless testing robots.